Hey everybody, it's uh, Mortgage Monday and I'm your host, Jim Cardinal. And I'm Alexis Meeks. there's some really good news at Syracuse Securities. That's right. This year we're actually celebrating our 50th uh, anniversary from the time that we've been open. So That's fantastic. Very great news. It is. I mean, I'm, you know, it's uh, it's quite a statement, especially you know, with all the troubles that mortgage banking has had uh, for the Syracuse Securities to be open so long. I'm, you know, extremely proud of it and uh, and I'm, I'm grateful to be part of this company. Excellent. Good. And now this week on Mortgage Monday, we're going to talk a little bit about VA loans. Yeah, I mean, it's one of those things I think it's been coming up a lot lately, probably just because of the amount of people that are entering in the military because of uh, some of the things that are going on overseas. There's just a lot of uh, VA loans that have been coming into the office lately. They're great loans, 100% financing, great, great rates, and uh, no mortgage insurance. So I think they're just super loans. I always tell people the biggest challenge with uh, VA loans is that most people aren't veterans. So that's, that's the thing. But if... if you have a veteran that you're working with, it's a super loan. They sound great. Is there anything as far as drawbacks to getting those kind of loans? Or Yeah, I mean, I think one of those things that, uh, you know, it's been a drawback on the, on the loan or things that people may have think negatively is that we don't control the appraisal. The VA actually uh, does the appraiser. And sometimes you get appraisers that are a little bit of sticklers, um, you know, tough on values or tough on the properties. It doesn't happen a lot, but there are a couple of those guys out there, but we don't control who gets it. So uh, you might run into those issues. But whenever you have a seller that wants to sell, a buyer that wants to buy, and all the other parties that are in invested in the transaction wanting to close, I think you can work through those issues. So they're, they're good loans. Fantastic. Yeah. And, and, you know, some of the other features that, you know, um, about the loan is it goes up to $417,000, um, which is, is great. It's a big loan. And also, I just found out this week, uh, we had a, a deal there. A person was buying a house for almost $500,000 and they were able to go VA as well. It's called a VA jumbo and they simply have to put 25% down of the amount over 417. Kind of a complicated, you know, not that complicated, but complicated to explain here uh, formula, but there is an opportunity to exceed that 417 with the loan. So it's a good loan. And I really believe in it because of the fact that, you know, the biggest obstacles that we face trying to get people into houses are uh, money out of pocket, and monthly payment and the VA loans have no out-of-pocket you can get into the house with like virtually zero out-of-pocket and it doesn't have mortgage insurance so it represents you know some really low payments so whenever you factor those two things in this loan really takes away those two barriers money out-of-pocket and low monthly payments so great loans Excellent. so this week you know if you're out there you, you run into somebody that needs a VA loan think of me Jim Cardinal FHA 203Ks uh, USDA's uh, Jim Cardinal, 281-0077. Make it a great week and we'll talk to you soon.